Hi guys. Just wait a couple of seconds till some of our friends show up. I am so glad you're here. It is I believe time. Make sure I'm doing this right. I'm using my computer. I think I've got it figured out. Let me know if you guys can hear me. Hi guys. Is the audio okay? Can everybody hear me? I am so glad to be with you. Okay, this is our normal I believe time where we usually all come down. Hi Luke. Hi Peyton. I'm glad you guys are here. This is our normal I believe time when usually school is over and the kids come down into the gym and we have about an hour to talk about God and Jesus and the spirit. And it is just my favorite day of the week. So we, oh goodness, I hope you can see this. I'm going to have to get it close. Today I want to read to you one of my favorite books. It is such a good book for when you might be a little afraid. And sometimes we get a little afraid and that's okay. I want to say a very special thank you to Mr. Max Lucado, to all of his friends at Harper Collins Christian Publishing Company for letting us be able to read this book together. Usually there are other ways during the week that we come together to read books. And now that things are a little bit different, we're going to have to find new and more exciting ways to read. So I want to read one of my favorite books to you. It is called I'm Not a Scaredy Cat. Gotta get my camera right. I'm a big cat. I'm a strong cat. I'm not a scaredy cat. Except when my rubber ducky squeaked. Oh my, how I freaked. I gave it a squeeze and as loud as you please, it let out a great big eek. The band on the street played tweet a tweet tweet. They marched in their suits and tooted their flutes. I nearly jumped out of my feet. Has it happened to you? Here's what I do. When noises are loud or I feel lost in the crowd, I say, God, can I talk to you? And then I pray, God, you are good. God, you are near. God, you are here, and God, you love me, and I feel better. I'm a big cat. I'm a strong cat. I'm not a scaredy cat, except when the monkey in the cabana grabbed the yellow banana. I hid under the table in case he was able to reach my big, bright blue bandana. A leaf from a tree landed right on my knee. I jumped with a bump, fell down with a thump, and that's what happened to me. The slides tippy top made my tummy flippy flop. High above all, I tried not to fall. What if I couldn't stop? It's frightening out there, and some things can scare. When you feel queasy, oh, so uneasy, may I suggest this prayer? God, you are good. God, you are near. God, you are here. And God, you love me. Then you'll feel better. I'm a big cat. I'm a strong cat. I'm not a scaredy cat. Except when the elephants at the zoo sneezed a ginormous achoo. I turned and I ran and I hid in a can. I did not know what to do. The caterpillar, all furry, crawled on my foot in no hurry. He sat and he stared. He hadn't a care. But my, how he made me worry. Are you ever afraid? If so, that's okay. When you feel frantic, there's no need to take it. Just turn to God and say, God, you are good. God, you are near. God, you are here. And God, you love me. And you'll feel better. I'm a big cat. I'm a strong cat. 
I'm not a scaredy cat, except when the baker in the store threw sprinkles galore. Yellow and pink, I shudder to think the baker might sprinkle some more. Tick tock, tick tock, the clock ticked and talked. I let out a squawk. I covered my ears and fought back the tears. I admit I was afraid of a clock. The rain made a splatter, a splash and a clatter. My fur was all wet. I started to fret. Getting soaked is no laughing matter. Next time you fear feel, next time you feel fearful, all skittish and tearful, take time to pray. I know just what to say to make you feel happy and cheerful. God, you are good. God, you are near. God, you are here, and God, you love me. Do you love that book? I love that book. Grownups, this is a book you want to have in your library at home. This is one of those books we read a lot because it makes our hearts feel better. And all my friends who just listened to one of my favorite books, it is okay to be afraid. God will help us with that. He'll stay with us the whole time we're afraid and make our hearts feel better. At the I Believe Club, we talk about how God blesses us, and so we want to be a blessing to somebody else. So every Thursday when we come together, while we're waiting to break into our groups, we always make a card for somebody. We pray for somebody, and then everybody in the whole group makes a card for them. So what I want you guys to do today is think of somebody that you can pray for. Maybe somebody in your family, maybe somebody in your church, or somebody in your community, and then send them a text or an email, or maybe send them a Facebook message and pray for them with your family or pray for them in your heart and then contact them and let you know that you love them and you are praying for them and that it's okay to be afraid. God is with us. He's going to take care of us. He does it every single time. So I am so glad you guys are here. I am so thankful to Mr. Cato and everyone at HarperCollins Publishing Company. Thank you for letting us read this book together. Monday, we're going to come back together at 3 o'clock Central, and I'm going to tell you my favorite story about Jesus in the New Testament. Okay? It's going to be great. So I hope you have a great day. Now go bless somebody.